Tony, I think we, I don't know, maybe we don't pop out in a... What is this? <laughs> what is this we got in front of us, cat? <laughs> what are we doing? We got 10 miles. So Julian just went into this cool Goodwill and Willow is not happy about it. <laughs> we stayed in the car because we've got Willow and we didn't want to leave her in the car by herself, obviously. So this was just a really cool Goodwill. We couldn't pass it up. So he's going in there to check it out. Willow is making sure he comes out. <laughs> Where's dad? Where's he at? Oh, he looks so concerned. He'll be back. He'll be back. So this is where we're at. Welcome to, so we're at something called, oh, Meadow View is the place that we're staying in. It's at English Creek Hideaway, and we found it on Airbnb. Look, they got like a little tent thing back there. Look at this. This is the outside area. Never get so busy making a living that you forget to make a life. Dolly Parton. Old Dolly. All right, so, oh, that's the pad they were talking about. This is the outside shower, I think. There is an outside shower. Oh, oh, this is the sauna. Yeah. So there's like a sauna here. We're definitely gonna do this tonight. It's already hot in there, like a sauna. It smells good though. This is a very neat place, but we, it's uh, it's really wide open. I guess you can close the curtains. Luckily, it's not raining. If this was raining, this would be probably not that cool. Is there AC in here? Nice. Look how cute this is. Look at the little refrigerator. Oh, that's like a tent. No, there's wood there. So this is the little Airbnb. I mean, it's, this is pretty cool. I have to admit. Something in there. Oh, there's like a little toilet. Little baby toilet. Little thing, little getaway. We got a grill out there. We got hot dogs later on. How do you like this? I like it. There's like a little thing up there. So we're, uh, Willow, we can move this chair. We put Willow right here yeah. in the kennel. So, Look, oh man, and we got mar oh, ro roasted, roasted marshmallows. Yeah. And little minis, we're gonna eat all that stuff. This is really, really cool. So most Airbnbs are going to have a book that people write in. Our thing that we have actually started doing right off the bat is reading some of the stuff in the book because it makes a lot of sense on what to do. Like one time we were at a trout farm. It told you exactly where to use or what to use, where to fish would catch all the trout. We didn't read it till the last day and then we caught all the trout on the last day. So what we do, there's usually a book somewhere in an Airbnb and we always read it. So this one, because there's so much here. I mean, there's like a cow walking over there. And he's got, look at that cow over there. <laughs> and I don't know if we can feed him or not. So we got to look, read the book to see if we can feed the cow. So hands down, probably the coolest place that we've ever stayed in Airbnb. Uh, one, they have goats, we'll show you. They have sheep, we'll show you. They have two cows with horns, we'll show you. Uh, and then like, this is the Airbnb that I already showed you like inside. Very, you know, small, all you need is a bed really. The outside sauna, the showers outside. You can actually take a bath right here. We're wondering what this is. And that's what that is. If you want to take a bath underneath the stars all you have to do is just fill that bad boy up this closes right here so because down there there is like another fence i mean down there there is another tent and somebody can stay there so it's like a little compound of airbnbs on a little farm in the middle of tennessee so we're gonna go down there they said i can pet the big no they said i can pet they said i can pet the small cow which is a cool thing. And then they said the goats are super nice and the sheep are super nice. We'll also show you the barn. There's a barn on the other end that has like ping pong, foosball, some sort of shuffleboard thing. And it's like in the middle that everybody can use. But so far we're the only ones here. And I did see that some of the people in the book stated that they were the only ones here when they got here. And um, so right here, this is the communal barn. So it's super cool. There's like tons of stuff to do here. You got a table here, play cards on, there's cards in that. 
there's shuffleboard, there's ping pong, there's really cool lights. I mean, this has gotta be one of the coolest Airbnbs ever. But we were just told that we can feed the goats. They said Doritos, but we're gonna feed them apples because we have some apples and guess what? We have and we have some goats <laughs> and some sheep. We're city folks, so we don't have a lot of animals. This is too cool. Now I want some goats and sheep. Come here. Hey, bud. Oh, that tastes good. Can I pet you? I wouldn't. Are you filming this? Yeah. <laughs> Oh no, because that one's they said it's mean. The big one. Oh, you want an apple too? I got What are y'all doing? What are you doing, brown cow? What are you doing? <laughs> this is insane. I think last time we stayed in a place that had miniature horses, I think these guys win. What are you? Because you're really cool. I want one. Alright, we're moving from the beach and we're coming up to the mountains to get one of these guys. You want an apple? No. He said, get that away from me. I'm done with you. You want apple? Come here, Samson. Samson. No. no. All the way over there. They said goodbye. They said goodbye. So it turns out we're the only ones staying at this area tonight, which means we have the entire barn to ourselves. We're gonna go in here and show you what the barn looks like at nighttime. I know it's super dark on the video right now, but wait till I turn the lights on. I mean, look at this place. You have this entire place to yourself. Now, if there is more people here, obviously there would be more people here. But since we had it by ourselves, we played ping pong. I'm not gonna lie, I won. We had shuffleboard down there, foosball, I won. I mean, I'm not the best. Kayla did beat me at bowling the other day. Turns out she's a professional bowler. I'm a pro professional shuffleboarder. But take a look at this. I'm telling you right now, this is an awesome place. If, I mean, we got our friends out here. This sheep. He's actually my best friend. He, so far, he's the only one that hangs out with me. Come here, buddy. What we're gonna do next is a sauna. They have a sauna in here, you throw some wood in, you, you put some like, I don't know, water on some hot stones or something, you sit in it. We're gonna see if we can get this thing going. As you can tell, it's a beautiful night in Tennessee. Turns out, Tennessee is a little bit different in South Carolina. Y'all don't have hot humidity. Like, the humidity here is super low. It's probably still hot because I'm sweating, but it doesn't feel like it's like a million degrees. So we're gonna try the sauna out, see how it goes. our night at the English Creek hideaway we'll see we'll catch you on the next one <laughs> all right so moving on to the next place where are we going next we're going to um <laughs> I don't know. we don't know but uh we're gonna shove off from this part of Tennessee head out to the other part of Tennessee tomorrow is the 127 there are probably gonna be some maybe early yard sales today so we're gonna start hitting the road. <laughs> 